Okay, guys, I'm, I'm building uh, some balance, um, a four to one balance. Now, we all know the um, how to wind them. This is this is the basic circuit that I'm using, and um, I think you can see that quite well. Anyway, it's a fairly easy circuit to to, to manufacture, and um, it's a great little balance to make. Um, it works quite well. I've got Type 41 um, ferrites uh, on the material. And uh, what I've done is I've wrapped the ferrite here in um, just cheap tape, you know, insulation tape, just the, the cheap stuff. Uh, little short pieces, wrap it around there so that the wires don't uh, scratch the, the enamel off them. Now, one of, one of the things about it is that uh, one of the guys just suggested to me one day, and I thought it was one of the most brilliant ideas I've ever heard. Um, I, I, I've tried marking these this bit of wire with texture colour, and um, so you can always work out, you know, um, what which wire is which. Um, this particular balance only got two wires in it, so it's not too bad. But what I discovered was a friend of mine, uh, VK3 ACJ, suggested that um, I get a little bit of shrink on. And what I actually do was I cut a small piece of shrink on, and um, I put a small piece of shrink on up this end here, just where the bend is and then another small piece at the end of that piece of wire. Now, if you're going to do four or five wires, of course you use different colours for the wires. But by doing that, when you actually roll the, um, the balin on, and uh, you get to the other end, um, if you notice here, see that there's a, a ferrite, the, the um, uh, shrink on us there, and the other piece of wire here on the curve, this is still curved, I haven't cut it yet, it's got a piece of shrink on on one side. So I know that that wire there is that wire there. And because it's the colour, you know, you can you do different colours for different wires. It is an excellent way of making the balance up. Of course, this is just going to be a standard balance for the quad loop, so it's no big deal. And uh, I'll just show you. So, OK, guys, there, there's the um, balance there. And uh, I'll cut and sew little wires together the appropriate way. The ferrite will sit into there. And uh, I, I um, here's another barn I made uh, four to one one on, on a ferrite rod. But uh, what I do is I use these eye bolts, and uh, what I do is I cut them off shorter, so that they only just go through the side of the box here. You don't want them sticking out half a mile. And you really don't want the thread hanging out here a long distance because what happens is the thread's a weak spot. So it's better off making a short thread and going and uh, putting them on the box. So I'll give you a quick show when I've finished it. But uh, the little trick is mainly using the shrink on on the bit of wire. It's, it's an excellent little trick that.